What, in a nutshell, have you done here in Iceland that nobody else in the world has done? Well, first of all, we began to harness the fire inside the earth to produce geothermal power on a bigger scale and more effectively than anybody else has done. In a sense, we have built up a model of how you can transform an entire economy from being based on oil and fossil fuel over to clean energy. You're calling it clean energy, but really how clean is it? And there are big hydropower plants in this country that have been built in the wilderness, and you're absolutely correct. In order to construct them, you have to transform the landscape. But the beauty of the geothermal is that you only drill holes. You don't have to change the landscape uh, in a big way. Iceland's unique geological profile means geothermal energy, both for heating and electricity, is in abundant supply. Its seven geothermal plants provide heat for more than 80% of the country's homes and a quarter of its electricity needs. There are almost 100 countries in the world that have this potential and have not really utilized it. What is interesting is that countries in Europe, countries in East Africa, in Asia, many states within the US and others are suddenly discovering that the heat under our feet is also under their feet. Uh, the fireball inside the earth is not just uh, under Iceland. It is under the entire uh, continent that we have. Iceland's big selling point is its cheap and reliable energy supply, attracting interest from energy-intensive industries. When you go to the Blue Lagoon, uh, you can go up on the roof of the new building and you can see on one hand the geothermal uh, power plant that produces electricity for an aluminum smelter and the entire city. But you can also see one of the most famous spas in the world. You can see a medical clinic and you can see the potential of the new borehole. Iceland has been a kind of a laboratory of how you can transform an entire society from the old 20th century system of fossil fuel based economy over to the future economy of clean energy.